Softube and UAD both have what they call the Essentials Bundle. And both of these bundles go for $49 at the time of recording this video anyway. And in my opinion, an Essentials Bundle should include everything you need to mix a song. And really there's just five different categories for plugins that are essential to mixing a song. Those categories are EQ, compressor, reverb, delay and time-based effects, plus saturation. So I'm going to go through and we'll grade each of these categories to see who comes out the winner. Now, the first category we're going to look at is EQ. And we'll start with the UAD Essentials Bundle, which includes the Poltec Collection. And this has three different Poltecs in it, the EQP1A, the MEQ5, and the HLF3C. Combine all of these together and you've got some legendary EQs for your projects. Also in this bundle, you get the Century Channel Strip, and it has a simple three-band EQ in it. For the EQ in the Soft Tube Essentials bundle, you get the British Class A Channel Strip plugin. This one has selectable low and high shelf bands, plus a selectable mid band. You also have low pass and high pass filters on there. And just like the EQ in the UAD bundle, this one is a legendary EQ. So who wins the EQ category? The UAD Poltex offer a little more versatility. Now, the 1073 EQ in the soft tube bundle, really, it sounds excellent and you can't go wrong with that. It's more of a preference thing. I think just with the UAD bundle, you get a little more versatility and you also have that Century channel strip in there. So you get a little more EQ variety as well. Now let's move on to the compressor category. And both of these bundles include emulation of legendary compressors. We'll start with the soft tube bundle and that comes with the FET compressor Mark II, which is their take on the 1176. And with this one, you get all of that 1176 goodness that you're used to from the hardware compressor, but Softube's added a little more functionality to it, like a drive section. There's also side chain options in there, and that makes this a little more versatile compared to just a plain 1176. However, you can just use it like an ordinary 1176 if you want to. Now, also to mention in the soft tube essentials bundle is that channel strip plugin that we looked at earlier, as it includes an excellent compressor. The one in here is based on the Neve 2254 compressor, which is excellent. Now let's have a look at what you get in the UAD Essentials Bundle. In here, you get the LA-2A collection. This features three different LA-2A compressors and each one of these has its own tone and character to it. So like the 1176, the LA-2A is another legendary compressor. Again, we can also take a look at the compressor that's available in the Century Channel Strip. And this one, I believe, is based on the LA-3A compressor, but it's just a one dial version of it. So who wins the compressor round? For me, the Soft Tube 1176 offers a little more versatility compared to the LA-2A compressors that are available in the UAD bundle. Plus, in the Soft Tube bundle, you also have that compressor that's in the British Class A channel strip, the Neve 2254, and that feels like another compressor plugin. If you turn off all the other modules in the channel strip, you can just use that compressor plugin, and it's a lot more usable compared to the one dial LA3A style compressor that's on the Sentry channel strip in the UAD bundle. So this one goes to Soft Tube, but it is a preference thing. If you prefer the LA-2A compressor over the 1176, then you're still in good hands because both of these bundles sound excellent. They're very top quality plugins. Now let's move on to the reverb category and the UAD Essentials bundle comes with the Pure Plate plugin. This is kind of a streamlined EMT-140 style reverb. It's quick to dial in your sound because of how easy it is to use. And of course, it sounds great.
Now, there's also a bonus reverb in this bundle, as there's a reverb in the Galaxy Tape plugin, which is based on the Roland RE201 Space Echo, and this provides you with a whole other flavor of reverb. The Soft Tube bundle comes with a plugin called Wasted Space, and this one is more of a lo-fi reverb. It over accentuates the artifacting of digital reverbs of the 80s. It's a nicely laid out plugin that's very easy to use. And for a lo-fi reverb, it sounds decent, especially if you love the 80s reverb goodness. So who wins the reverb category? For me, it's UAD. That pure plate sounds excellent. Plus you get that bonus reverb in the Galaxy Tape Echo plugin. It would have been nice if Softube, in addition to the Wasted Space plugin, also added their TSAR-1R reverb plugin, which is a really nice streamlined reverb. Next, we'll look at the delay and time-based effects. And with this one, there's a very clear winner. So in the UAD bundle, you get that Galaxy Tape Echo plugin. And like I said earlier, it's based on the hardware Roland RE201 Space Echo. And this is a very cool tape delay and reverb plugin. The hardware version's been used for years and it's been heard on many hit songs. You can use this delay and reverb on guitars, vocals, synths, and you can even try it out on your drum send or get crazy with it on any instrument as you can have a lot of creative fun with this plugin when using automation. The Softube Essentials Bundle doesn't include a delay or time-based effect, at least at the time of recording this. So the clear winner of this category is UAD. Now let's check out a category that's very close, and that's the saturation category. We'll start with Softube. This one comes with the tape plugin, and it has three different tape machine styles in it. It's very straightforward to use. On the surface, you can see all of the basic controls, but there is a more advanced section in here, just in case you want to get into even more detail. It's a very nice tape plugin that you can use all over the place. The UAD Essentials Bundle comes with Oxide Tape Recorder. And this one's a mix of their two popular tape plugins, the Studer and the Ampex. They've really streamlined the workflow of this one, making it super easy to use. And again, this one sounds great and it can be used all over the place. So who's the winner of the saturation category? This one is so close. On the UAD side, you have a plugin that combines two of their most used and loved saturation plugins. Now on the soft tube side, you have an excellent sounding tape saturation plugin that really deserves a lot more love. This one really comes down to what you prefer and I can't choose a winner here because they're both winners. So I'm going to make this one a draw. One, one for each. UAD takes out top marks in these categories based on what my preferences are. Of course, your preferences might be different and you would grade them different. This is just based on my opinion. It's not an official thing or anything like that. And there's one more category that each of these bundles includes, and I didn't mention it earlier, that's the instrument category. With the UAD Essentials Bundle, you get Polymax, and this one's kind of based on a bunch of different vintage synthesizers, whereas in the Softube Essentials Bundle, you get the Model 84, and this one's based on the Juno 106. Both of these plugins sound great, and it really depends. Do you want an excellent sounding Juno 106 that does a very convincing Juno 106, or do you want a bunch of vintage synthesizer sounds in the UAD Polymax? But for this video, I really wanted to focus on the effects plugins for mixing. And if you want to check out some of the best free effects plugins, check out this video right here. There's some great stuff in there. And if you liked this video that you just watched, please give it a thumbs up. Also subscribe to the channel for more videos like this. Thank you so much for watching. For Audio Tech TV, I'm Zane. Keep creating. Fist bump. Thumbs up.